Hey everyone, welcome back if you have been here before and welcome if you are new here. I'm Amy and I will be your yoga teacher for this quick pick me up yoga class. So this is a class for when you're a bit more short on time for a full length class, but you still wanna get some movement, get breathing, get connected to your body. So it'll be quite a fast paced class, not too much time spent stretching or chilling out. So if that sounds like something that you're up for, come and meet me on your mat. If you do make it to the end of this class and you enjoyed it, I would love to hear from you in the comments below, letting me know what you thought or leaving any requests for classes you'd like me to film in future. You can also give the video a thumbs up to let me know that you enjoyed it. And of course, subscribing to my channel is appreciated so that hopefully we can be on our mats together again very soon. So we will be starting today standing up at the top of our mat. So getting the energy going right to begin with. Just start to find a little bit of movement here. The suggestion is to close the eyes so you can find the movement that feels good. Feeling your way into it rather than thinking your way into it. So you might just start small, having a little sway from side to side, moving around on the feet. A little bend and sway through the knees, a little wiggle through the hips. Getting that movement into the arms, head and neck. So no need to think about what I'm doing. Let that movement come from a place of intuition. Finding the movement that your body needs today. And as you move, can you start to connect to your breath here? Big expansive inhales in and out through the nose if that works. Breathing in a way that brings space, energy, expansion on each inhale. And that brings a little bit of release, relaxation on each exhale. However you're moving, make it even bigger, more expansive, more expressive. Just let everything go. Maybe having a little shake here. Moving with freedom for one more breath and then we'll eventually meet in our Tadasana. Grounding through the feet, lengthening through the spine. Inhale, reach the arms all the way up. Exhale, bend the knees forward, fold down over the legs. Inhale, flat back, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, plant the hands, step back into a high plank. As soon as you arrive, rock forwards and backwards on the tiptoes. Here for three, two, and one. Inhale, shift far forward onto your tiptoes. Exhale, lower all the way onto the belly. Inhale, lift the chest, cobra pose. Exhale, press it back. Downward facing dog. Let's pause for our first time here. Pedal out through the legs. Move the hips from side to side, feeling to the shoulders. Again, the movement, bringing space into the body. What movement do you need here to open up those tight places? Inhale, lift the heels, come onto the tiptoes. Exhale, step, pop, jump, float, top of the mat. Inhale, halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, reach and rise all the way up to standing. Come onto your tiptoes when you get to the top. Exhale, keep the heels lifted, cactus through the arms. Inhale, reach the arms up, lift onto the heels, lift the heels even higher. Exhale, fold down over the legs. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank. As soon as you arrive, start those rocks. For three, for two, and one. Lower all the way onto the belly. This time, inhale, hovering cobra. Lift the hands, find a cactus shape through the arms. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a big breath in. Stay for a big breath out. Inhale, bend the knees, press it back. Exhale, make your way forward, top of the mat. 
Inhale, lift and lengthen through the spine. Exhale, fold and deepen over the legs. Inhale, reach and rise, lift the arms, lift the heels, stay on the tiptoes, cactus the arms, exhale. Inhale, lift the arms, lift the heels even higher. Exhale, fold it down. Flat back, big inhale. High plank, big exhale, rock it forwards and backwards. Shift as far as you can forwards, lower all the way down. Inhale, hovering cobra. Exhale, downward dog. Big breath in, big breath out. Inhale, lift the heels last time. Exhale, take it forward. Inhale, Ad Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, reach and rise. Lift the arms, lift the heels. Exhale, cactus the arms. Inhale, fingertips lengthen. Exhale, fold over the legs. Inhale, long spine. Exhale, high plank. Rock it forwards and back. For three, for two, and one, lower down, inhale, floating cobra, exhale, downward facing dog, breathe in, breathe out, bring your right fingertips onto the side of your head, elbow is bent, inhale, right elbow to the left knee, exhale, inhale, open the elbow out wide, exhale, tap the knee, three more, breathe in, Breathe out, inhale, exhale, last one, breathe in, breathe out. Now inhale, open the elbow wide, roll open into a side plank, maybe readjusting the feet here, bringing them staggered, so right foot a bit further forward, left foot back. Big breath in, right knee, right elbow, big breath out. Inhale, step the right foot back down. Exhale, bend and tap for three. Last two. One more time. Bend and tap, pause. Can you keep this contact between the knee and the elbow? Big step forward with the right foot. Come onto your left hip toes, finding a low lunge with the elbow on the knee. Inhale, straighten the right arm, reach the fingertips all the way up towards the ceiling. Exhale, lower the right hand onto the floor, lift the left leg, standing splits. Using the strength of the leg to lift it even higher. Step the left toes all the way back, reach the arm up, big inhale. Lower the right hand down, lift the left leg, Big exhale, a few more like that. Inhale, twisted lunge. Exhale, standing split. One more of each, big inhale. Big exhale. Now this time we'll take it into that twisted lunge and pause. Roll into revolve skandasa. Outside edges of the feet, dropping the left hip down towards the floor. Inhale, lift into the hips, reach the right arm forwards. Exhale, tap the hips back down, reach the right arm back. Four more, inhale, push up. Exhale, lower down. Last three. Last two. Last time, lift up and pause. Get nice and steady through your left hand and left foot. Step your right foot all the way over into a wild thing. Big inhale here. Stay for the exhale. One more breath, maybe play around with hovering your right tiptoes away from the floor. Then if they're not already lifted, can you lift your right toes Roll the right hand down, squeeze the right knee in towards the nose. Kick the right leg back to hover, keep it lifted. Lower chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. 
exhale, downward facing dog. Take a big breath in. Stay for a big breath out. Lower the elbows to the floor, dolphin. Lift them back up. Lower, lift, down and up. Let's do five, four, three, two, and one. Bring your left fingertips to the side of the head, elbow bent, inhale here, exhale, left elbow, right knee. Inhale, elbow wide, exhale over to the right hand side. Let's do three, last two, one more time. Open the elbow out wide, run to the edges of the feet, Vashistasana, feet are staggered, inhale here, exhale, left knee, left elbow, inhale, side plank, exhale, elbow to knee, for three, last two, one more time, elbow to knee, pause, can you make contact? And keep that contact as you step the foot all the way to the top of the mat. Come onto your right tiptoes, finding a lunge variation. Inhale, open the left arm all the way up towards the ceiling. Exhale, left hand down, right leg lifts, standing splits. We'll move through those two shapes. Inhale, twisted lunge. Exhale, standing split. A few more times, big inhale, big exhale. Two more, breathe in, breathe out. Last one of each, big inhale, big exhale. Inhale into that twisted lunge, Exhale, revolve Skandasana, rolling onto the edges of the feet, dropping the right hip down towards the floor. Five times, inhale, lift the hips up, reach the left arm forwards. Exhale, lower the hips, reach the left arm back. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. For three. Last two. Last time, lift up, stay lifted. Pick up your left foot, step it up and over into wild thing. Big inhale here. Big exhale. One more breath, maybe hovering your left tip toes away from the mat. Then let's all roll our left hand down, draw the left knee in towards the nose. Kick that leg back behind you. Lower down one-legged chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more big inhale. One more big exhale. Inhale, bend the knees, press it back. Exhale, hop, step, jump forward, malasana, top of the mat. Hands to heart center, press the elbows into the inner thighs. Have a little moment here to wiggle from side to side, feel into the hips. Open your left hand down towards the floor. Reach your right arm up towards the ceiling. Bring the right fingertips onto the side of the head. Inhale here. Exhale, tap the right elbow down towards the floor. Inhale, open up. Exhale, lower down. Let's do three. Last two. One more time. Now open the elbow up and pause. Bring the left fingertips onto the side of the head as well. Come to stand on your left foot, lift your right foot, tap right elbow to right knee. Lower all the way back down, Malasana. 
up to the other side, stand onto your right foot, left elbow, left knee, lower all the way back down. Last time, step up, tap right elbow to right knee. Can you actually make contact? Pause, hover and hold. Then keep the fingertips on the side of the head. Bring the sole of the right foot to the right inner thigh. Maybe you're doing that hands free. Reach the arms all the way up towards the ceiling. Big inhale. Big exhale. Lift the left heel to hover. Tap it back down. Lift it up and lower. Let's do three. Two and one. Draw the right knee up and in towards the chest. Step it all the way back, high crescent lunge. Draw the knee in, open it out to the side, tree pose. Point it forwards, step it back a few more times. Stand, draw the knee in, open it wide. Point it forwards. Step it back one more time. Knee to chest, open out, point it forwards. Step it back, find your high crescent lunge and pause, big inhale. Warrior two, big exhale. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, skandasana to the back of the mat, bending into the right knee, extending the left knee. Open the right hand down, reach the left arm up, twist, fingertips onto the side of the head, tap the elbow in the direction of the floor. Inhale, open up. Exhale, tap it down. Three more, breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale. Exhale. Last one, lift and lower. Keep the left hand on the head, bring the right hand onto the head as well. Keeping the arms on the side of the head, can you press all the way back up into your warrior two? Lean out over your front leg, reach the fingertips forward, fingertips back to the head, lift the spine back up. A few more times, lean, reach, bend, back up. Let's do three. Last two. Last one, lean and reach and pause. Straighten the front leg, power triangle. Left hand down, right arm up, step onto the front foot, lift the back leg, add a Chandrasana half moon. Breathe in, breathe out. Reach the right arm forward, inhale. Right knee, right elbow, exhale. Inhale, extend the arm, extend the leg. Exhale, bring them in. Let's do three. Last two. One more time. Elbow to knee. Can you make contact between the elbow and the knee? See if you can keep that contact. Come up to stand on your left foot. Draw your right knee up and in towards your chest. So the right knee is pointing up towards the ceiling. Step the right foot next to the left, bend both knees. Bring the left hand to meet the right. So you're in a chair pose, but with the elbows on the knees and the palms pressing in towards one another. Keep that contact, lower down into a toe balance with the elbows still on the knees. Lift the elbows away from the knees. Point the fingers forward, straighten the arms. Roll yourself down to sit, lift the heels, find Navasana boat pose, lower down to hover, low boat, all the way back up, knees to chest. Lower down to hover, bring it back in. Let's do three. Last two. One more time, pause, hover, hold. Cross the ankles, plant the hands, step or jump through a vinyasa. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe in. Breathe out. 
lower the elbows, dolphin, lift them back up. Keep it going, lowering and lifting, finding a pace and a rhythm that works. For three, two, and one. Lift the elbows, bend the knees, press it back. Hop, malasana, top of the mat. Pause for a moment, feel into those thighs, those hips. Lower the right hand down, open the left arm up, twist. Bring the left fingertips onto the head, big inhale. Elbow to the floor, big exhale. Inhale, open up. Exhale, tap it down. Let's do three. Last two. And one. Open it up, bring your right hand onto your head as well. Come up to stand on your right foot, tap your left elbow to your left knee. Lower it back down, Malasana. Other side, right knee, right elbow, falling along the way. Lower it down. Bring it back up and pause. Can you actually make contact between your left elbow and your left knee. Then release the foot, place it on the right inner thigh, finding Vrikshasana, tree pose. Reach the arms all the way up towards the ceiling. Five times, lift the right heel, lower, up, down, lift, lower. Last two. And one. Left knee to chest, step the foot back, lunge. Knee to chest, out to the side, point it forward, step it back a few more times. Forward, to the side, forward, step it back. Knee in, open out, point and step. Last time in, Open, forward, step it back, find your high lunge, take a big inhale. Open out, warrior two, release a big exhale. Inhale, reverse your warrior two. Exhale, skandasana to the back of the mat, bending the left knee, extending the right knee. Open the left hand to the floor, the right arm up to the ceiling. Right fingertips onto the head, breathe in. Elbow to the floor, breathe out. Inhale, open. Exhale, tap for three. Last two. One more time. Open it up, elbow out to the side. Bring the left fingertips onto the head as well. Then hands free, can you press back up into your warrior two. Lean out over the front leg, extend the arms, bend, come back upright, a few more. Lean, reach, bend, bring it back. Let's do three. Last two. One more time, lean and reach and pause. Straighten the front leg, power triangle. Right hand down, left arm up. Step onto the front foot, find your Adha Chandrasana, half moon. Left arm reaches forward, breathe in. Left knee, left elbow, breathe out. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bend for three. Last two. One more time. Can you make contact between the elbow and the knee? Keep that contact, come all the way up to stand. Reach the right arm up to the ceiling. Keep the left elbow on the left knee. Step the left foot next to the right foot, bend both knees. Elbows are on the knees, hands meet one another. Chair pose variation. 
lift the heels, come onto the tiptoes, toe balance variation. Point the fingertips forward, lift the elbows away from the knees. Roll onto the heels, sit down, then lift the feet, come all the way into your low boat pose. High boat, a few more. Lower, lift, take it down, bring it up. Last three. Last two. One more time. Cross the ankles, plant the hands. Chaturanga. Up dog or cobra. Downward dog. Big expansive inhale. Full complete exhale. Tap the elbows down. Lift. Lower. Lift. Let's do seven. Four, three, two, one. Lower the elbows down, keep them down. Step the feet back into a forearm plank. Roll onto the edge of the feet, tap the hip down. Bring it back through center, over to the other side. Keep it going from side to side. Let's do one more each way. Come back through center. Roll the knees, the thighs, the belly onto the floor. Sphinx pose. Maybe press the hands into the floor. Lift the elbows, find seal pose. Lower the elbows, slide the hands by the ribs, wave the hips to the heels, find a child's pose. Just a minute or two of stretching to unwind. Start to let your breath slow down here. Big breaths in and out through the nose. Release a little bit more tension on the wave of each exhale. Roll yourself up to sit on the heels, place the hands on the knees, inhale, open the chest, drop the shoulders down and back. Exhale, chin into the chest, round the spine. A few more times, inhale, expand and open. Exhale, release and round. One more time, breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, twist to the right. Place the left hand on the right knee. Right fingertips might land on the floor or wrap behind the back. Keep the left hand on the right knee. Reach your right arm up and over towards the left hand side, finding a nice side body stretch. Place the right hand on the left knee, cross over at the elbows, chin into the chest, round through the spine. Then unravel your left hand, bring the fingertips behind you, landing in that twist on the other side. Reach your left arm up and over towards the right side of the space, big breaths into your left side. Hand on opposite knee, cross the elbows, tuck the chin round. Unravel, roll your way up to seated. A few breaths here with a neutral spine, soft shoulders, crown of the head extending up. Then eventually, if the eyes are closed, you can softly open them, return to your space. And that is you done with that quick energizing 30 minute practice. I hope it brought a little bit of vitality, some life, good connection to your breath and to your body. 
Like I said at the start, I would be grateful more than ever to hear from you in the comments what you thought about this class. I would love to get a thumbs up so that you know, so that I know that you liked it. And if you would subscribe, that would be amazing so that we can be on our mats together again, enjoying some yoga very soon. But more important than any of those things is that you have an amazing day, stay healthy, happy and well, think peaceful thoughts, speak peaceful words, feel peace in your heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you.